Hi, I'm Sarah Snow and this is my student house. You know, all stories are recycled, but this is a story about recycling. It's got everything. Friends, rivalries, teamwork, even a Prince Charming. Oh, and a fair amount of hygiene problems. And as for recycling... Yeah. First, it's time to meet the other residents of the house. Cue the music. Handsome, but utterly selfish when it comes to cleaning. Lazy, uncaring and, well, pretty useless around the house. Good for a laugh, terribly unreliable. She's angry. A lot of the time. A time bomb waiting to go off. She doesn't even pick up her tissues. I wouldn't even want to see the state of his room. And as for this snow white wannabe, no wonder she's in such a good mood every day. She's never once separated rubbish in her life. Needless to say, I have my work cut out. It seemed as if their luck had finally run out. But at least they handled it well. Pick these up and put them in the bin. That's all you need to do. This is We're out for inspection tonight. You need to get this place sorted by then or we're out. What about you? Well, I'm going to work. Since I have nothing to do with this, it's up to you. Things were getting out of control. Fortunately, the gods of student lettings for you were looking down on them. never seen a place so filthy in my life. I had no idea what to say. So, in the end, I went with... Um, actually, I'm just looking. No point, we're getting evicted anyway. Not if you just clean up. Don't you guys have a recycling system? This was going to be a long day. What came next were a series of unsuccessful attempts at teaching these bozos how to recycle. In the end, the only way I could teach them was by breaking it down into six main points. Key point one. Drink cartons and tetra packs are cardboard. Put them in your paper and cardboard bin. And with that, we were off. Key point two, flatten all your cardboard to give you more room and make it easier to dispose of in the bin. Key point three, if the item is bottle shaped, is plastic and has had a liquid in it, it can go in your plastic bottle, glass and tin bin. Key point four, Remember, your shampoo and conditioner bottles and deodorant bottles can go in the plastic bottle, glass and tin bin. Key point five. Only use your general waste bin for anything that cannot be recycled. And recycling was just the beginning. And the final key point, all your leftover food you don't want can go in your caddy, including tea bags and mouldy fruit.
So, here we are. Not quite what I was expecting when I went in for a house viewing this morning. But at least there was an upside to all this. What the hell? Who did this? We did. Isn't it beautiful? We all did. Who the hell are you? She's new. It was a tense moment. It could have gone either way. Come on, guys. You know the score. Hey. <laughs> I'm Sarah, by the way. Nice to meet you. And likewise. You know that I work at the Children's Hospital, right? Oh, don't even start. I love this place. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>